Ladies and gents, hello and welcome. My name, of course, is Obita Potato. This is Domina. Uh, we were dominating in the last episode, and let's attend a pit fight because... Uh, I was feeling so good about myself. Now, there's two of us and two of them. And our Murmillo is obviously the best that we have. So I'm not super confident putting our second guy in because he's so much more worthless than the other guys, but I was told to do pit fights. Pit fights are good, and if we can win, then that's great. Now, bear in mind that we only need to get a single hit on the enemy from our Murmillo, and it kills them. And as you can see, literally saving the day, he's absolutely bonkers. But he did take some damage. We do need to make sure that his armor is top-notch, and we also need to start taking into the defense tree in order to... Uh, in order to in order to make sure that this guy's defensive capabilities are slightly higher than they currently are because they really are not very high right now uh let's get you healed up thank you very much uh i would love to purchase a brand new gladiator unfortunately we can't really get anyone that's really worth a damn let's not do that right now then let's just continue working on our uh Offensive upgrades, which are happening at a decent rate, I would say. Uh, oh, good, good, good. We're seeing uh, some stuff upgrade in here. Recipient's morale never fails. I do like that. That's kind of cool. Yeah, we're just work we're just watching everyone sort of upgrade themselves, which is kind of cool. Uh, throw weapons. I don't really know why. I've I've never actually done this before, which is which is kind of interesting. Uh, sell the horse at the city. I'm gonna sell the horse. Awesome. Great job, everyone. That might allow us to purchase another gladiator. 300 coin. Um, I kind of want to go for an expensive one, but obviously I can't right now. So we're going to have to going to have to wait it out, I think. But I'm okay with this. I'm okay with this. Uh, let's grant some freedoms here. Keep morale high, I guess. How is morale doing? You're pleased? You're pleased. Grant freedom. Sell you. Sell you. Let's keep you around. I'm kind of interested in training you up. I don't really know how good people are. I never really look at it, but I just sort of look at how much they sell for. And then I <laughs> and then I can tell how much thingy they'll be doing. I think the selling price is a really good indicator of, uh, of how good a gladiator is. All right. Good. Let's keep on buying wine. Wine's actually really important in order to maintain 260 wine. God damn it. You're now agreeable. You're satisfied. I need to upgrade. I need to make you happy as well. God damn it. That's depressing that we're spending so much money. Well, I say spending so much money. It's a lot of work in order to make sure that uh, our dudes are happy. So are you at max level yet? You're not at max level yet, but you're or you're not at max equipment yet, but you're getting there. You're actually really close. If we can get the favor to upgrade uh, you a couple more times, then you're you're going to be pretty pretty darn good. So throwing weapons is done. Now we're going to do berserk. Gladiators at less than 10% HP will receive a strength and agility boost, not compatible with automatic yield. Uh, Mermillo is probably the one after this that we want to go for, and after that, finally, 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 we're going to get defense, shuffle, disarming shield, all of that bollocks that will uh, allow us to raise the defensiveness of the Mermillo, which is what we are really, really interested in. Uh, I'm going to keep on checking back here occasionally because I really do want to strike a deal perhaps, maybe on another Mermillo because I, I do like a I do like a good Mermillo. Maybe I've just, you know, lucked out and got a bunch of Jupiter Jupiter's blessings that are compatible. But um, two chained lines? Chained lines are not even relevant. If they're chained, that is. Um, maybe I've just lucked out and got a really good Mermillo. Or maybe the Mermillo class is broken and we should exploit that. I mean, you know what I mean. Exploit that within the realms of the... Within the realms of the game. Yeah, there we go. Three hits. And that was actually... I would say... Uh, a rather more... Uh, maybe maybe you underperformed there. That's what I'm trying to say. Because usually we do a little bit better. Usually we do it in like two. Uh, either way. A good showing all around. 580 coins. Uh, Thrax. Thrax. Don't really care that much. Don't really care that much. Continue to buy wine, buy food, buy all that good stuff. 
Hmm. 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 219 days left. I can honestly say that I think that we're in the best position that we've ever been in. Honestly, 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 I can say that. I really do. Maybe we want to... Maybe we just want to buy a gladiator. Oh, shit. You're a Retarius. We've got an option of two Retarius. I think we take this one. Yeah, I actually think that's a really... I mean, it's not a good deal, I suppose, but it's kind of worth it. Okay, let's get you healed up. You're... You're in a pretty okay state, I guess. Being a Retarius and all that. Yeah, I mean, you do, you do need a lot of stuff repaired, so I think I'm going to try and keep you off the off the, the, the circuits for a wee while. Uh, a fugitivus was found near your villa by one of your guards. He was armed for battle, but weary from drink. Your guards took captive, and the slave now rests in the ludus. Both the magistrate and the legate claim to have a quarrel with the man. Claim that the slave has been stolen from you. You have a new fighter. You are a grave disappointment. Is this guy legit? No, he's he's terrible. How much? 67? 67 to be sold off is not is not bad. It's not bad. It's not, not terrible. Uh, you should be training for meditation as well. I'm afraid, buddy, you're training for meditation and you are not training for meditation. Good to know. Uh, you also need to be training for meditation. So I guess even though this guy is not very good, we still keep him. Let's put you over here. So you are... You're selling for 14, so... You're going to sell for 13, so you're pretty good as well. You guys are 6, and I imagine you're probably yeah, about the same. Yeah, perfect. So let's put you guys at the back. And we've got the A team, the B team, and the C team, right? That's kind of cool. I'm kind of happy that we've got, like, three tiers of people. Okay, let's get all of that nonsense sorted out. Also got money right now. Maybe we should do a pit fight. Maybe we should. Maybe, 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 maybe we should. We'll probably do it after the next battle because I want to make sure that everyone's in tip-top fighting condition for the next official battle with the uh, with the legate. I wish I could click on this, um, or, uh, me, the player. I wish I could click on me, the player. Uh, that'd be kind of nice if we could do that. Anyway, let's go to battle. One AI, well, I want uh, one uh, one gladiator. I wonder who I'm going to be picking. This guy's Retarius. We could actually get uh, trapped here. I've, I don't think I've. He is chained though, so I guess that's okay for us. But a Retarius is kind of worrying. 168, uh, 160 HP. This guy's going to be a considerable challenge, I think. We've got to get lucky here if we want to win. Oh, sorry, sorry. Whoops. My bad. I forgot that we can deal regular hits for 224 damage. What the fuck is that? What the fuck is that? Okay. Jesus Christ, that's so much damage. I was also thinking, we still haven't unlocked mindfulness. After Berserk, perhaps we want to go over Mermilla training and then mindfulness. Because we've got some really legit Jupiter's Blessings that we could, uh... We could, we could add on here. Running and speed increased by 35%. I mean, that's not really essential, but I guess we can stick that on you. Uh, I, I guess we'll... Yeah, I guess we'll put this on here. Sure. I mean, it's a bunch of shitty Jupiter's Blessings, but it's not bad. Uh, let's attend a pit fight. Let's pick our gladiator. Let's pick the best and only real one that we have. We have another Retarius here. No obstacles. Uh, surrender is allowed, which is kind of nice. Now, he might be able to throw his trap around me. Or he might just choose to not do that. And we might just win with one hit. Um, as you can tell, that is exactly what happened. Man, it feels so good. You know, once you've got the ball rolling and you're uh, you're just constantly winning battles, it's kind of it's kind of hard to stop you if you get a if you get somebody decent. Okay, Berserk is done. Uh, Mermillo training. And we want mindfulness and then Mermillo training. In all honesty, which may seem like a little bit of a weird order, but I think that's the right thing to do if that makes sense. Uh, so are you maxed out right now? You probably are maxed out. If you're not maxed out, you're gonna be bloody close. Yeah, so... One thing away is the studded iron, uh, plated skirt. You're very, very close indeed to, uh, to unlocking that. 
Uh, you, on the other hand, you need a cons—I say a considerable amount of effort. But a Retarius is is nice to have, for sure. We'll upgrade the leg plate on you. A detachment of Pompey soldier traveling to battle the legate suggests that your villa might be a suitable place. Uh, sure. Legate is embarrassed. The detachment commander was not impressed by your unwillingness to help. Pompey will hear of this. Really? Disquieted. God. We need to hire the guy that allows us to... We need to hire the employee that allows us to kill the legate. I would definitely love to do that right now, but we can't. Hey, you're now max level, right? Oh, no, you've still got the sheath of Mars to go. I'm not interested in doing that. Uh, can we purchase a, a dude? Mm, kinda. We could purchase this guy. But they're all Thraxes. Don't really care about that. I mean, they're alright. They're good to have around, but they're not... They're not essential. Mm, food and water. We're both out of food and water. It's a bit of a shame. And wine, we should be basically buying wine on on demand. Pit fight. Yes, of course, we should do a pit fight. Great. Great. I kind of wish we got fewer slaves and more resources of, like, food and water and whatnot. Wow. 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 This guy is nuts. This guy is absolutely... <laughs> Fucking nuts. <laughs> this guy's bonkers. This guy is bonkers, bonkers, bonkers. I don't even know how it happened that we that we have someone that's so good. It just he's just great. Like it's just weird. Grant freedom. Uh Grant Freedom. Grant Freedom. Grant Freedom. What are you Grant Freedom? You're probably pretty decent. Yep. Let's keep you guys at the back here, just in case. Uh, now you should be full level, right? 100%. You are maximum, maximum level, my man. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Mindfulness is done. Uh, Mermillo class, do we care that as much about as Mermillo class? Let's do evasive roll first, sure. I feel that that's, it's, it's better to, you know, get these defensive abilities sorted out before we go for the Mermillo class, because we will probably turn both of these guys into Mermillos as soon as we unlock them, so there's no real rush to do that, because we're still going to need to acquire a lot of money in order to make them, uh, in order to get them upgraded. One gladiator. Legate. He's not a big fan of me. He's not a big fan. Chained enemies. Surrender is allowed. Perfect. Uh, if the enemies are chained together, then I imagine that they won't be able to run away from each other, which means that we might be able to just finish them in one fell swoop. Like, in one hit. Because I think that this this blade is cleave. Oh, well. Didn't manage to... Well, it was actually disappointing. We didn't manage to finish them in one hit. We managed to uh, do it in two, though. So, in all honesty, I'm not really going to complain about that too much. Uh, also, speaking of mindfulness, we should be able to... AI control gladiators can react faster. There we go. Add you there. Increase running speed. Sure. Defending during an attack can interrupt the attack 50% more quickly. Sure. There we go. Okay, so let's have a look. Purchase gladiators. Anyone remotely interesting? No. Not really interested in a Thrax. A Thrax. Low stance, rolling attack. Low stance or rolling attack. Well, we don't care about automatic yield, okay? Because that's not compatible with uh, with Berserk, so we're not going to be able to get that. Gladiators suffer less knockback when they're knocked out. Uh, deep breathing. Uh, allow their HP slight recovery. I don't really care about that. Can escape net entrapment more easily using this attack. Increase your agi... Uh, I think we go deep breathing grip techniques. Yeah. And besides, it's only like four, uh, four days. So that's really, really good. Uh, yep. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. If we've got a really good gladiator, then it turns out the pit fights are great. If you don't have a good gladiator, it turns out the pit fights are terrible. But the great news is that as the pit fights go on and on and on... We get more and more levels and stuff from pit fights. So once the snowball is well and truly rolling, I don't think that there's much that you can really do to stop it. Which is really, really nice. Uh, people are hungry. That's good. How is our Marmillo? You're pleased? Honestly, dude, you're, you should be fucking... You should really be very happy with yourself. You're, uh... You're doing some great stuff. Uh, can we purchase a gladiator for some money? Thrax. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. I am kind of inclined just to say, hey, let's upgrade everyone. Gladiator appeal. Uh, no. Dude, you're our best dude. You're our best dude. Let's 
give him wine. Let's give him money. Uh, when you give people wine, sometimes they respond by upping their agility points. And yeah, it turns out that that was one of those instances. So that's great. We've given people some wine and made them a little bit happier. I didn't think that they used to... Uh, I didn't think that they used to ask to be freed, but now they do apparently, which is interesting. Man, we've made so much money off this guy. I feel I feel really bad keeping him around, but he's really really good. I want to try and make sure that for the um for the championships in Rome, we have a real a real team of gladiators. So people that are as good as this oh my god, he took a lot of hits to kill. Uh we have we want to have lots of people that are as good as as this Mermillo right here. So we really, really, really want to make sure that we get a lot of, a lot of good people. A dual wield master. What does dual wield master do? Because that seems, if dual wielding all attacks do fifty percent more damage. Okay, let's get rid of uh, speed strength train on this guy, and put in everything else because you are dual wielding. I think I, I don't know if it's technical dual wielding. If it's not technical dual wielding, then it's kind of useless. But. Yeah, this is Y Hander Plus. So I think this the game might count this as dual wielding, even though it's only one sword, right? But it's a big fuck off sword, basically. Uh, low stance, no. We want grip techniques, and then defensive shuffle, then disarming, and then dismemberment. That's right. That's the path that we're going for. Do you have anything for me? No, you do not. You are fucking useless, as per usual. During the festival, several villas are burglarized and their slaves freed. Both the legate and magistrate have lost slaves. Uh, unfortunately, you can only provide enough men to keep one. Uh, help the magistrate. Help the legate. There we go. Unfortunately, yeah. You need my help in order to become a little bit happier with me. And you were... Uh, you're a little bit upset yourself. I, mm, I didn't think that that was the case. Oh, well, what can you do? Not very much, as it turns out. Right, so these two guys are... Oh, upgraded to fancy leather skirt. Good to know. Here we go. Let's just upgrade your helmet a little bit. Uh, after grip techniques, we're actually going to go for Mermillo class. Thank you. Thank you. So There's literally no reason for us to, um, to sell anyone off, really. Like, there's no... There's no real incentive to do it. I think we're actually benefiting more from just granting people's freedom rather than selling people off. Because whilst selling people off would give us money, and that is, you know, always a nice thing to do, attend a pit fight, we will do that after this battle. Uh, money's always nice, right? But let's be real, I care more about the fact that people are uh, going to like me at the end of the game, which is, which is kind of what we're going for, right? There we go. Let's do it. There's some... Lions? Are they chained lions? Yeah, they're chained lions. It's not even... Like, what's what's the point in chaining a lion up? I suppose, like, you can't run away, but I would never run away because I'm not in a position to run away. You know, I, I don't control the enemy. Uh, let's see. Purchase gladiator. A Retarius. I want a Mermillo, if possible. But it's okay. We're unlocking Mermillo next, so that's kind of nice. I also feel that it's probably getting roundabout time that we should start thinking about the regional championships. Um, and by golly, I'm worried about doing it. Very, very worried indeed. Because apart from one dude who is very, very trained in battle, we have no one else who is well trained in battle. Which, which is goddamn worrying. Three gladiators. Okay, this will be a good test of the other gladiator. The other A team. Or the B team. This is the A team, and then this is the B team. Half the B team here. I don't know how this is going to turn out. I really have no idea how this is going to turn out. Obviously, uh, Mermillo is going to do great. I hope he's going to do great, but this could go either way, really. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. All right. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> they just bunched up and they were just one shot. <laughs> wow. But that, again, this is not great because we're not really getting to see anyone else do anything. And that's a problem, right? Because we, we're not getting to see the skills of the other gladiators. We're just not getting to see the skills to pay the bills. 
<sighs> Gosh darn it. God, you're so bad. You're so bad. Why are you even B team? You're 9, 10, 7, 7. This guy is 13, 13. Yeah, you should really be. You should really be changed around. No, we need to deny their request. I'm sorry, dude. I'm sorry. I know you're encouraged, but by golly. Okay, grant freedom, grant freedom, grant freedom, grant freedom. Sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do. A detachment of Pompey soldiers come across your villa, but they are without a commander. You think they're deserters. Uh, fearing they may forcibly take your villa, give them respite. Uh, give them respite, but secretly send a message to the legate. Okay, let's do that. The legate and his men descend upon your villa, only to have the coward deserters slip away under the cover of darkness with some of your precious wine. The legate chases after the men late into the night, but he suspects you made up the whole story since he couldn't find a trace of the men. You're shitting me. Really? Wow, what a fucking bellend. What a fucking, fucking bellend. Will you offer me any gladiators that are decent? Nope. Nope, 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 nope. Not at all. I kind of want to splurge some money on some of these people, but I really can't justify it. Not quite yet. Not quite yet. We need to get Mermillo class done first. Oh, God. I also really want to go for... Maybe just... Let's go to a games. Let's go to a... Let's go to do a games. Yeah. This guy's a Mermillo. So this guy does... Bonkers damage. Let's do it. Let's just fucking do it. We just need to. God damn. We need to just start doing these tournaments. It's just really, really important that we just do the damage. Now, if the Mermillo is taken out first, then it's just a real problem. That's perfect. All three of our guys survive, which is great. That's really, really good. Um, we did sustain a fair amount of damage, but we don't really care about this, right? All we need to do is make sure that the Mermillo that we have can deal the damage. Um, after that, I don't really care about anything. I think we just want to make sure that we tank up everyone who's not the Mermillo, right? Like, if we just have tanks, and then we have the Mermillo. Uh, we need to get you healed up. And you healed up, too. You're god-awful. You're so fucking bad. Is everyone training, uh... Yeah, meditation. Great. Mermillo. We're just waiting... There we go. Perfect. Let's equip you. Perfect, perfect, perfect. You back there. Um, we've got a decent chance of upgrading those guys from scratch. I'd rather not do that, but I, I just don't want any fucking Thraxes. I want some fucking decent classes. I don't want to. I don't want to. I don't want to be purchasing Thraxes at this late stage in the game. I just don't want it. I just do not want it. Thank you very much. I do not want it. It's just not something I'm interested in doing. <laughs> what? <laughs> it doesn't make a difference if we're chained up. If the enemy's chained up, it's just... That's just brutal. Anyway, ladies and gents, on that brutal execution, I'm going to have to say, my name, of course, has been Oliver Potato. This has been Domina. Thanks very much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.